Why, hello, everybody. How are you? Here's the plan, Stan. Poppy's gonna let these discs fly like crazy, and we're gonna get the job done. That being said, we got a whole lot of veins in the mix. Oh my gosh, what? Listen here, fellas. Oh boy, I don't think we've ever gotten a three-star tier one yet. I don't think it's happened. Okay, but I am digging the BF swords, that's for sure. Give me more veins. Give me more veins, dude. I'm addicted. I'm actually addicted. Uh, hmm. Looks like we're chilling with this for now. Okay, here's the plan, folks. Putting in three sentinel would be juicy, but we're gonna need this gold quickly to make that happen. Uh, oh boy. We're gonna say goodbye to the pre-level, but say hello to whatever the heck we got going on right now. Honestly, I'm a fan. I'm a fan of this. Let's send it. Putting in these skirmies would be lovely, but we'll go to five quickly and place it on in. That'll be so strong. Oh, so strong. This guy is insanely strong as well. What in the world? Dude. <clears throat> of course we go against one of the strongest people early on. My gosh. Uh, Olaf, take this. Hopefully that helps. Sentinel bonus is nasty, and MF getting bad ultis like that is massive, dude. Wow, I actually thought we weren't going to win that one. You got to respect the scent and nasties, baby. You got to respect them. We'll take this for now, and I'm curious to where it will lead us. That's for sure. Oh, this skirmisher sounds juicy. Do we put it in over the tier two vein? Honestly, probably should. Who do we dare hook on up with this? Yo, what's up with everyone being so freaking strong? You take that, my friend. As for what else we've got, let's see. We'll sell the deer. We already have our skirmishers we care about. We'll buy this little young fellow and ay ay ay. I'm so sad right now. You cannot beat a level two Olaf early game. It's impossible. Impossible. Huh. This is a bunch of random crap I don't think we care too much about. Oh my gosh. Selling like both of these, leveling up, putting in vain would be slick right now, but that's not the case we're uh, going for. Something I've been absolutely loving though is when you win the first two rounds and you jump to level five on this round right here. It feels so good to do. I can't explain it. All right. Give it a shot. You might fall in love with it as well. But let's see here. Um... I'm trying to think of the situation. What is something good we could bust on out? Spear Sojin wise, you know who actually surprisingly has a Spear Sojin in the best in slot item of his build? Aphelios. So what if we just take that to the next level, baby? Rage Blade Spear Sojin is some of my favorite combinations in this game. Alrighty. Hi, Noctron, how you doing? Mm-hmm. We'll go with no nocturne, but this works. Ba -da -ba -bam -bam, ba -da -da -dum -dum. Give me all the bro Laughlins you've got, baby. And I'm saving up to. Oh boy. I really, really, really want to hold on to these Rangers for that combination come down the road. You know what? Screw Econ. Boom, baby. Our team comp just gets so much better. This looks so much more beautiful. We had to do it. Let's see. Can we drop anything? We're one champion off of leveling up all of these. Wow. <clears throat> you really hate to see it. You really hate to see it. If we lose this off of even leveling up, I'm going to be so sad. We actually might. A BT set tier 2 is pretty much as scary as it gets. Oh boy, we lost our Kha'Zix to do his thing, baby. But, honestly, our uh, AD from Skirmisher is skyrocketing on up. I love it. We could drop both of these. Good. I feel like we have to for Econ. We're keeping the vein. Everything else can peace on out. Okay. Wow. Do we sell the pike now as well for Econ if we win? We're just dropping our champs left and right. I don't know how to feel about this. Hey, Verus. How are you? How are you? So, I'm calling it now. I can see the future. We're going to get a Spear Sojin. A Rage Blade. Or a Zeke's off of our shiny item round, and it's going to be mwah, beautiful. Bum 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 bum. Wow. Ah, feels good 
That's kind of cool. It feels weird not to take these champions. It really does. But if we get Econ, I might sell this Diana. I really like the Galio. But maybe Diana can go. Yo, is this where we pivot to 5 Draconic right now? Hitting the 2% Galio is so rare. Oh my god, dude, it wants us. Give me an Ash and I'll send it. I'm not even joking. I will do it right now. <laughs> 3 gold, 4 gold, 30. Don't mind if I do. Bye bye, Diana. This is so interesting. That was a Draconic Krug round if I've ever seen one. My goodness. Um, huh. Let's see here. If we lose, I think we sell this Olaf and move on to bigger and better things come the round after. Our arch nemesis, Spear Sojin Ash. That's who we gotta take on out. I really let you take this, have some fun. I'm pretty sure we lose this, so my expectations are definitely not high, that's for sure. Actually, every single round you play with Sentinels, it looks like you're gonna lose. And then the most random thing ends up happening. I love it. Give me an Ash or Set right now. I dare you. Okay. Or not. That's fine too. Uh, we actually don't get much stronger at all if we do level up here. But I like the odds of these champions going crazy if that's the case. I'll sell this if I have to. Bum, 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 bum. Guys, let's get ready to rock. Let's get ready to rumble. Vayne, just kill everyone, please. Oh my god, this cannon's actually gonna pop off. No, sorry, dude, we're scraping by with these wins. I am so in love with 3 Sentinel, it's actually stupid. And we also got a 5 win streak literally out of nowhere, which I love a lot. Huh. We could even mess around with the possible 6 Sentinel somewhat early if we find a random Senna. Wow, okay, that's pretty cool. Um, huh. Honestly? Whoa! Dude! That's what I'm talking about! Literally out of nowhere, we'll take the Lucian over Senna any day of the week. Six Sentinel, let's see how this bad boy looks. We lose out on the Skirmisher shenanigans, but... I'd say picking up this fatty shield every who knows how often is probably worth it if you ask me. Bruh. <clears throat> Bruh. This thing just keeps on popping everywhere, left and right. And there's nothing they can do about it. Dude! <laughs> I love this! I kind of want to buy this. Oh boy. Nidalee, I am so sorry. I need to prioritize the piggy. As for champions... Oh my god. We got another 100 HP boy in the building. This guy... Wow. Six Hellion. Turns out it's pretty freaking solid throughout the early game. But I think our Econ might be the best in the game so far because of our win streaks and just we have, I feel like we've played pretty greedy all throughout. You dirty dog. All right, looks like we're taking this. Okay, that works. <laughs> oh my gosh, that skirmisher is something else. Dude, 32 gold. I really hope this is worth it. I think it has a good chance of being very worth it. Hot dog. Let's wait till we see what we get from this round. Then we'll decide more of what the heck we do next. But a one th or a 800, 1000 shield with a fatty attack speed buff. Sounds pretty nice if you ask me. Especially once it lands on Jax. Whenever it lands on a skirmisher, it's a wrap. <clears throat> That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Jax gets low and never dies because of said shield. Dude, it keeps on bouncing back on him. I love that. <laughs> this is a dirty, dirty opener. Spending, uh, like losing three gold of interest this round to put in this type of shenanigans. Beautiful. Now we got to put this together. Um, 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 a lot of allies, health to allies, whatever you want to call it. This not so hot. Maybe this is not bad. Super Shroud, let's think. Starting mana for all allies. I mean, that ain't bad either. I'm trying to think. I'm gonna go with this. I've liked it a lot in the past. We're gonna see how it goes here. Shields across the board with Sentinel shields added on in. 
Uh, Jax, you take this. <clears throat> Not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous. Just a wee bit. And I'm curious if this guy will ever die. <laughs> Dude. Oh my gosh. Um, I think he'll die? Double BT plus the spooky warmogs, aka shiny warmogs. Sorry, I still call it spooky. I know, it's bad. Those days are over, buns. Give it on up. Let's see what wolves throw us a bone on. <clears throat> what you got for us, buddy? What you got for us? Let's do all of this. And our econ's looking good. Our gold is looking beautiful. Hot dog. Okay. <clears throat> Maybe we chill like this. I want to level up this Lucian, but we also got to be smart about this whole thing. Hmm. Oh, boy. Nautilus would be so insanely strong as well. Are we just going to go to level 8 like now or what? This guy's also rocking the MF in the back. When he's going to be casting a whole lot. Double Sojin with the spooky one. You know what I mean. This is something I wanted to bust on out myself too, but uh, oh boy. Lucian. Don't die, buddy. Oh my god. No items on this guy is actually mutastic. He does not do much damage. Well, so much for our win streak. Jeez. Um, 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 um. What do we want to pair with this? We've got some options. I say let's rock with this. That works for me. Now we can basically pivot our team comp into literally anything because of uh, what we've got so far. Also, putting in Senna over one of these random Sentinels would be extremely nice just to give this Lucian Cannoneer to help out with the damage. I think that's our biggest issue right now is our damage. Yep, yep, yep. We're going to start taking a beating. Da dong Ooh. I like this a lot. You guys down to get wild with it? I'm actually down to send it on this guy. We're gonna put a lot of faith into whatever the heck we've just got. No Senna, no thanks. Um, Broloff, let's do this. This kinda sorta works. In a very weird, weird way it does. Helios, take that my friend. And I should have put in Ash over whoever the heck we just put in. Whatever. All right. Aphelios, I believe in you, buddy. Okay. Aphelios ultimate with Deathblade, Rageblade, Spear Sojin, insanely strong. We're going to do our best to take that to the next level to see what we can create with whatever the heck we're about to create. I want to see this guy ulti over and over and over again. Oh boy, oh boy. Akshan would be freaking juicy, but I feel like we should prioritize one of the items we need the most. Oh boy. Now later, Akshan. Tito, get in my belly. This works. Get ready for the spam of a lifetime. I hope you are. Dude, this is going to be fun. Okay. This is going to be really fun. I think rolling at 8 is probably what we should do the most, but I know we can just get so much stronger right now if we find a single somebody that we can utilize. Mm. Uh, how much do we hate this? It's interesting. It really is. I didn't even need desire for the Draconic. I'm an idiot. Uh, I say we go to level 8, then we can have some fun. <laughs> the random 3 Draconic, not sure where that came from, but we're rocking with it. Aphelios, we're gonna need to uh, up your damage a bit, buddy. He, he ults a lot. <laughs> I mean, he ults a lot, a lot. 8,000 damage, not bad. Let's see what else we've got. Jax, don't care. Vayne, don't need it. You can almost run in 5 Draconic at this point. I mean, why not? I'm probably going to run this 5 Draconic up until we lose so we can drop below the 40 HP mark. That sounds very, very good to me, okay? That over Udi would be a little cute as well, and uh, I'm curious how much we can get this guy to actually spam his ult. <clears throat> Obviously the death blade in these shenanigans, not bad, but 
Hey, a little more ranger on top. Who knows what's gonna happen? You know what I'm saying? Bane, I'll just buy you because why not? Okay, that's a little more than seven damage that we needed to take. Time to drop the Draconic, folks. We got one golden goose egg. Watch it be the 1%. Oh my god, I'm gonna laugh so hard. Check it out, check it out. Okay, nope, definitely not the 1% egg. I'll tell you that much. Thank you very much. And okay. These things, not so bad. As for champions, oh, why, hello. Hello, how you doing, baby? Huh. I say we get rid of the Heimerdong. We need to put in a Brawly tank over this uh, Zyra, that's for sure. And Heimerdinger, I think it's time for you to go too, my friend. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Let's see here. Don't need the deer, don't need the Zyras. Ash, how you doing? Let's think. This is okay. I mean, it's not amazing, but it's also not horrible. You know what I'm saying? Is there one more Sentinel we could actually throw in? I don't think so. I don't think so. All right, let's think about this. This one's for you. And maybe we commit to a Chalice of Power for Aphelios. So he just deals that little extra oomph of damage. Honestly, I could see it working. Oh my god, that was close. <laughs> Oh my gosh, good job, no item ash. I respect that. Here we go, here we go. Last whisper, that sounds kind of cute. I should probably run that. Yep, yep, I definitely should. Alright, that works. How many veins are they gonna give us? Seriously. Um We're gonna roll like crazy starting now. Do we care about this Diana? This is what I'm curious about. Honestly, going for Nightbringer might just be the move. It'll up Aphelios' damage in a very interesting, weird way, which is ultimately what we care about the most. I mean, I think I like it. I think I like it. Level 2 Aphelios with the Chalice of Power, with the Dawnbringer, Nightbringer, whatever it's called. Hey, we're on to something here, fellas. I think we are. Bum, 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 ba -dum. Don't need this guy, and we'll hold the least sins. Why not? How many of these do we buy, though? That's the Oh, my gosh. Yes, dude. Honestly, rolling now while people are alive is more often than not a pretty good idea. Let's say I screw you to this ash and go crazy. Okay, maybe not. Maybe, maybe that was a horrible idea. Yeah. Yeah, it kind of was. Oh, God. Why'd I do that? Ash, I'm so sorry. I really am. Oh, boy. Okay, this works. Wow. All right. Forget I did that. <laughs> or maybe we just commit to it and maybe try our best to find a tier 3 Aos. I kind of like that idea. You know what? Screw it. Let's send it. 40 gold, screw you Ash, looking good, looking solid. We got a Nico as well, so we're technically only three away. That's pretty close considering the um, point we're at right now. I'd say a tank item will go a long, long way for us, that's for sure. A long, long way. But, anything to buff our boy up as well? Oh gosh, okay. Bramble was definitely the right move, that was my bad. Even Assassin, so Diana has a buddy, wouldn't have been too shabby. But screw it, lots of people are going to die soon, so we might want to go ahead and commit to it now. Oh gosh, you guys think this will work? Do you think this will work? I'm nervous. We're going all in. <clears throat> We're going all, all in, dude. Holy smokes! Now is basically like our last call to do so. So, I mean, we might as well go wild. 
Might as well go wild. This guy's out of the picture. We'll smell you later. Okay, guys. We're out of all of our gold. Oh my gosh. Do we dare drop this Galio to see if it'll take us to the promised land? I say we do it. One more and we're there, dude. One more. And we're there. Bro, I can feel it. Right on. <laughs> oh my gosh. I need, I need to chill. I actually need to chill. Okay, this guy, he was the rank one boy earlier, but Hellions coming late game are saying goodbye to their spunk. If you ask me, we have Akshan draining people's armor, as well as Ash with the Last Whisper, and Aphelios dealing all the deeps across the board. I love it. Bum, 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 bum. Stone plate. Hey, I like that. Count me in. Honestly, we got a pretty good frontliner. Speaking of, uh, or for our Galio here. Okay, I think next round, that's when we hit it. I can feel it. I can feel it. What did other people get? Giant Slayer, Sojin. A grappler, that sounds pretty nice. Oh god, I didn't grab my thing in time. You know what? I'm not gonna reroll a crazy amount, but it's kind of hard to explain why. I think I like this a wee bit more as well. Get on in there, bear boy. Get on in there. Huh. All right, the pig's back. What can I say? <clears throat> We're still doing okay. And we have one, maybe two rounds to spare. I'm a little worried. No GA on Bully Bear scares me a bit. And I'm telling you right now, this ulti spam from our boy Aphelios is so beautiful. <laughs> I love it. All right, you go wait over there. Brawler bonus, that's cute. Loaded dice, say hello. This will guarantee that we get it. I feel like we have to. If we don't get it off that. Houston, we got a problem. All right, screw it. So I loaded dice. Yeah. Gotcha. Oh my gosh, we did. Yes, please. Thank you very much, dude. Watch us hit it without having to drop the Nico. Imagine. Oh my God. <laughs> It actually happened. That's way too funny. Bruh. Bruh. This Aphelios just got scary. Now he's got some damage. Okay. Now he's got some damage. I'll show you in just a second. It basically tripled though. It basically tripled. Now these ults are actually going to start slapping. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. Um, I think he just deleted the entire map. I'm pretty sure that I think that's what happened. I'm fairly certain that's what we all just saw, correct? <laughs> that was crazy. Um, hmm, I guess we're looking for the boob. Diana, don't need it. Also, Akshani Shan. Okay, we should probably chill. Here we go. Here we go, folks. Are you ready? <laughs> Here's the damage I was talking about. 840, but uh, that adds up a lot, okay? Considering it takes into account a lot of his AD, what do we want here? We have armor already. Honestly, popping this sucker off is probably the best thing we can do. It's a 1v1 mono we mono now, my friends. So here's the plan. Drop the Nico here. Get the Zephyr off. Looking to hit this Lucian will swap like this and away we go let's see okay that was lag um honestly I'm gonna get this poppy out of the equation I really don't like this poppy so let's say bye bye that is a tank I did not want to deal with later later my dude oh god that's a good Lucian old but you can say goodbye too <laughs> An insta 30,000 damage nuke. Okay. That was a little crazy.
That was a little crazy. No. <laughs> I'm thinking uh, Aphelios might be best in the middle here. As weird as that sounds, I think it's definitely the move. And I also want to hit this Poppy again. Huh, how do we do that though? You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna hit the Lucian. I'm curious if smacking this tank will be a bad thing for us. How you doing, big guy? <clears throat> How you doing? He's gonna come down, and Diane's gonna say hello with the uh, Ultimanto. Yep, he did absolutely nothing. I love this. Dude, the ulti spam of Filio Slapper. Oh my goodness, that's a wrap. Guys, fatty thumbs up. I would appreciate it a lot. Let me know other video ideas you want to run. And if you want to check out the stuff I'm doing outside of the game, it's C9BunnyFufu on Instagram. Hopefully, I'll see you there as well. All right, peace, peace, peace. Thumbs up helps a lot. Bye.